hello guys welcome to my class today we are going to learn how to analyze and design a steel truss concrete design and steel design is same is different between in the concrete design we use the material as concrete and the steel design use steel rest is the same okay so at first open stat pro click on new project click on truss okay select the truss option length unit same as the concrete design meter and kilo newton okay then click on next then click on add beam then finish okay we are designing this truss okay you can see it is distance 2 meter for pay height is 3.6 meter and this is in nodal load okay and this is pin support and this is fixed part okay so we are going to front view and we are going to change the grid go to edit spacing is 2 point sorry this thing is 2.4 in the x direction see 2.4 because this distance is 2.4 and the upper distance is 3.6 so it will be easy for our, us drawing upper is 3.6 ok now zoom it a little now our distance is 3 2.4 4 is 4 money into 4 okay and upper is 3.6 in the middle so start here 1 2 3 4 okay now our base is complete now press control from going to upper and not linked this but you can link this okay in the middle and end here now switch off the snap node grid now this is our figure and now join the nodes as per our figure middle a perpendicular and these two nodes will be joined now same as the concrete design go to add beam add the nodes now add the nodes ok now uh, this portion is complete now we have to add this point to this point ok you can add this node to this member of the middle by two options you can break the member into two part or you can as you can go to member you can insert the node in the middle or you can add the member in the perpendicular ok I am going to add the beam as a perpendicular Or you can insert the node for that select the member go to right option click on insert node click on add midpoint and ok now it is a midpoint now it is the same right up click on the right on the beam insert node add midpoint now in the midpoint a node is created now go to add beam and just add the beam now our figure is complete now we have to give the support for that go to support page click on create now we have to add the 
pin support and the fixed part it will release in the fx and mz okay then add it now according to our figure the fixed part will go on the left and pin will be right this is pin and go to the right click on assign to selected nodes and assign and yes and fixed part will go to the left similarly assign to go assign to selected nodes assign it yes now have to go to the member property okay now go to the section database okay now he is still select your code and uh, I'm going to select Indian okay now I'm going to select angle you can select any angle I'm going to select the up one material is steel add it close it now it goes to the total structure so select it select beam cursor select total beams click on assign to selected beams assign it yes okay now go to the load page go to load case detail click on add click on date title date add it close it click on date add click on self word click on nodal load in the fy gives 8 kilo newton in the three upper nodes so we give minus 8 to fy then add it close it self it goes to the total structure and nodal load goes to the upper three node press 3 and press control from your keyboard okay then assign to selected nodes assign yes now our load has been given click on load to scale it okay now we have to analyze it go to command analyze perform analyze okay analyze run analyze analyze take some seconds okay this is complete zero error zero running zero nodes okay perfect click on done now have to design it go to design steel design select your code i'm going to select is 800 as an indian click on select parameters select your parameters i'm going to select fyld okay select el strength of steel now select it okay now define the parameters 25,000 ok add it close it it goes to the total structure assign to view yes now go to comments add the check code for us check the adequacy of member based on specification of desired code ok I have select a angle okay now if the for the total structure but we have to give the star member as the member have to resist the load it may the angle have been changed the member property can be changed so that's why we go for the check code then go to the member takeoff it provide it tabular report of the total length and width of section used in the structure on a member by member basis okay add it then go to the select 
now what is select select least weight section size based on specification now the specification size weight gives it add it and take off provide a tabular report for the total length and width of all section user in the structure okay add it close it now it will also go for the total structure so click on assign to view assign yes still member take off assign to view assign yes select assign to view assign yes select take off still take off assign to view assign yes and then again analyze it comment analyze perform analyze no print ok then analyze run analyze save okay there is no error no warning and no notes so our analysis and design is perfect so you can go to the output file this is a steel design okay for different member steel take off steel design you can see the angle it says pass 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 okay not fail is the result close it you can check any member fails if any member fails for that go to select by specification all fail beam you can see no beam failed for steel because we selected the select option okay it provide which the angular property can take or resist the loads so we go to the post processing okay now you see the displacement okay you can go to the axial force the force is on the upper side and these two sides shear on y shear on z torsion you can see and then bending y and see the beam stresses see upper two side and these two side and then see the reaction for two supports this is 12.81 kN and this is 12.81 same ok you can see the animation for deflection apply ok because we give this a pinned and fixed part so you can go inside in other side or you can go to the report select what you need or you can select all click on ok and now this is your output okay all the output file has been given here okay. so that's it that's how you're gonna design and analyze a steel struts or steel frame so keep subscribe subscribing on my channel and if you any doubt or if you want to know something then you can comment on my video i will get back you soon so Thank you for watching my video.